Hey sir, this is Jeff Walters here at Parabellum Combat Systems. We're going to go over disassembling the bolt carrier on an MP5 and a 53 to give you an idea how to get to the uh, firing pin spring and also uh, look for wear. We'll start out with the MP5. MP5 is very simple. Rotate the uh, locking piece till it'll come out, which is there. Pull out the firing pin. Here's your firing pin spring. Look for any damage in the coil, uh, cool binding, broke spring, that kind of thing. Going back, very simple. You'll see it has a key. Key goes into the slot. Turn. Go ahead and place your bolt head on. Get it right here. Turn the key just a little bit. Place the bolt head on. Turn. You're back in. 5391s, uh, any of the rifle cartridges are going to have a bolt head retaining lever with spring. It's going to make the bolt head more difficult to get on and off, but I'll show you a method. First, what you want to do is you want to uh, turn the bolt head towards you, remove it, remove the locking piece, and you can get to the firing pin and firing pin spring. Same on it, you want to look for any coil binding, you want to look for any breakage in the spring, any the spring being compressed. Place it back into the carrier. Same thing, you have a key. Keys in the upper portion, turn. I always turn mine until the 15's up or to the locking piece angle. Put it in, click. Now here's the tricky part. Take your thumb, press out. Turn. Now you can place it back into the uh, carrier. If this gets locked back, you're not gonna be able to place it back into the receiver.